Okay, family. So let's talk about uh, <laughs> Jada and Will. Okay. I want to pull three cards for Will because he has given us a formal response in regards to the hoopla that his wife has been making for the past two weeks. Okay. And uh, maybe this will be my last video on Jaden. Oh, sorry, not Jaden. Jada and Will. Okay? So. I have the archetype cards here. I am going to pull a few cards on Will. All right? Because one of the latest things his wife is saying is that uh, she's bisexual. That she... Uh, She's experienced women. She's had a few relationships with women. <laughs> uh, and uh, But she really does prefer men. Okay, Jada. So anyhow, let's pull some cards on Will, first of all. Okay? You know, it's really alarming, actually. Well, I mean, why should we be alarmed? But it is interesting to hear her say that even though they're not living together now, that she will be living with him in the future. <clears throat> well, he travels a lot anyway, so, you know, it's not going to be like they're going to be under each other's feet. Let's pick three cards here for Will. Interesting. Next card. Interesting. Next card. Interesting. Okay, family, you want to see the cards? Here we go. First card that we have here is Pioneer in Reverse. Second card that we have here is the Midas Miser in reverse. Third card that we have here is Priest in reverse. Now remember yesterday, Megan the Stallion in the oracle reading that I did on her yesterday, she got the monk or the nun in reverse. And here we have another spiritual leader religious figure here in the reverse in will smith these are the three energies in him right now in terms of archetypal energies okay pioneer in reverse now i think if will smith was to know that this card came up for him he would have a bitch fit he would throw a hissy fit. He would reject it in Jesus' name or in the name of whatever cyborg he worships. Because if there's one thing about Will Smith, he wants to be recognized as doing something new. He don't climb all them mountains and uh, swim to the deepest parts of the ocean and go on those great hikes and stuff like that. You know, he reminds me of Oprah. Oprah is forever going on hikes. But look at what happened the other day in, in uh, Lahaina, in Maui. Everybody's houses, more or less, burned to the ground. But Oprah and all of her friends whose houses were painted blue, all the wealthy folks, their houses were not touched. Well, it's this same kind of reverse pioneer energy. I'd expect this card to come up for Oprah. Oh, yeah, I would. Because Will thinks, and he, he comes across as very, very innovative. You've seen him doing all those kind of um, AI and robotic and the sophisticated technology things that he, even his response showed him like in all the different wonders of the world and put him in all different continents. And that was his response to you. It's like, you stupid minions. Don't ask me about foolishness. Don't ask me about mundane crap. Can't you see I'm busy conquering the world? Going to these great heights, but spiritually he's very low. He's not high spiritually because whether he's affected by this or not, and even if him and Jada are trolling us, 
Well, trolls have very, very low base energies and they're basically trash. They're not good people at all. They are absolute fodder. And so likewise here we have the pioneer card in reverse where a man who would make it seem as if he's done this, I'm doing a new thing. It's the first for me to do this and so on so no. What has Will Smith discovered and made available to us that has benefited our lives? What has he been the pioneer of? Pioneer card in reverse. The shadow attributes of this card say that, um, uh, yeah, having to keep moving all the time. Topsy turvy, changing his mind all the time, type of thing. Next card that we have here is the priest in reverse. Now, isn't it funny that him and his wife said that they were trying to heal and help? August Alcina. Do you remember? They said he came to us for help and we tried to help him. But here we have priest in reverse. I think Will is not talking because if he talks he might reveal too much. Disclaimer entertainment purposes only. You see People like Lauren Hill has talked about priests in reverse. People who are in position of trust, people who are in positions of authority, people who have been uh, elected by man to represent God, to be the intermediaries between we the common folks or we human beings and the divine. That's the priest's role to be the intermediary. You confess. When you go into the confession box, you confess to the priest. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned, etc., etc. But here we have somebody who is in a position of authority who is, is not a good person. So as much as we bash Jada, the other side to Jada's coin is him too. The shadow attributes of this card is it violates, violates the trust of your spiritual community seduced by your own spiritual role. Does that sound like Will Smith to you? seduced by his own spiritual role all i can think of is poor august and anybody else who came into contact with that pair i'm talking about will and jada i, I consider them to be a very dangerous couple i really do very dangerous not sincere inauthentic and I feel that they're so damaged and compromised that really there'll be no good to anybody else's mental health or anybody else's growth and development. Hi and bye and that's it. Hi nice to meet you. Oh great to see you. Bye. That's it. No chit chat, no dinners, no going out, no relationships, no small talk, no nothing with people like that. The next card that came up for Will in reverse is we have Midas and Miser. Interesting. Okay, let me show you the card when it's upright. Midas and Mider, and it says that. Um, Wait, open my glasses on so I can read it properly. Hoarding money and emotions. Obsessive fear of losing your wealth. So he's tight. <laughs> and mean. And he couldn't be, he could never be a sugar daddy. 
He could never be in a relationship where he's got to be in a relationship with an equal. It can't just be any old girl. You know, you'll never see him with some kind of, you know, just gold digging girl or guy. Because he's tight, he's cheap, he's mean. Midas or miser. You know, the Midas, King Midas, wasn't it everything that he touched turned to gold? Like literally everything? But how how good is it if everything that you touch not only turns to gold, but turns to, to, to hard, cold metal? Where it has to be really, it has to go back in the fire or it has to be really, really manipulated to make it into something else. So once he's touched that thing, it's it's made whatever he's whatever he touches that is what it becomes it doesn't become anything else it cannot change it has to go through fire and pressure to be melted and to turn into something else so it's the negative effects of the Midas touch which which the moral of the story is yes gold is wealth but if you touch a person and they turn into a piece of gold, you're using them for their value, but they can't do anything. They can't do anything with themselves. You've made them into what, like the goldsmith, makes the gold into the pendant, the ring, the chain, the earrings. But it has to go back through fire in order to become liquid again. To be so that it could be molded into something else. And miser, cheap and mean energy. So there's a chance that even if Jada does divorce him, would she get anything more than what she already has? Since they didn't even have a prenup anyway. But it seems as if that's when Will's aggression, well, it doesn't seem as if, but possibly, possibly, we might see the aggressive side of Will if, if Jada ever decides to divorce him, or if he decides to divorce Jada. The card that I most dislike, to be honest with you, I think you probably know which one it is, it's the priest, the priest in reverse. I think many people who come into contact with Will, and why is Aunt Viv coming up into this? Aunt Viv, remember the actress, Janet? When she talked about how Will changed, how he switched on her, how he become so bomber clot rotten to her. How he became a wicked mother F towards her. Froze her out, isolated her, and then had her sacked. Remember? You remember what Aunt Viv said? So this energy is coming upon the priest here. That kind of... When people get close to him... They really see that he's not a nice person. Either he was like that before he married Jada, or the two of them been as bad as each other. The two of them, they say iron sharpen iron. Were the two of them the same? But to be in a position of trust and to exploit people or to seduce or be seduced by your own spiritual role. His, his ego, he is so seduced, I would argue, based upon the spiritual energy of these cards and the energies, that he is seduced by his own self, his ego, that he cannot recognize God. And so when his wife talks about him being able to cope with suffering, and it's a new level of suffering. Who the hell does she think she is? And also, does that mean that because, because he can endure suffering, he can't go to God? 
Because you don't have to suffer in this life. You can go to your God. You can go to your ancestors. You do not have to suffer. So why is she coming out with this bullshit making people feel that, oh, you know, look at Will. He's so rich and he's suffering. He's suffering because he's an egomaniac. He's had a natural position of authority and, and a professional position of authority and he ain't helped nobody with it. How many people have come out, young Hollywood, young actors and actresses in Hollywood, young rappers, etc. How many of them have come out and said, you know, Will's a good guy and Will put me on and Will help me with this. With his status in Hollywood, who did y'all help? Y'all didn't help nobody. No one. Nobody. <laughs> Self, 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 self. And this mumbo jumbo, this bullshit about helping August Alsina, I would argue, based upon readings that I've done, which are for entertainment purposes only, but based upon that, my own opinion is they didn't help August one bit. In fact, they made him very sick. You can see the outcome of his hanging out with them. If we're pissed off and tired of Jada, we've only had one to two weeks of her bullshit. Can you imagine how she, how, how she did August, as, aside from sexual the in, entanglement? Anyhow, here are the three cards. And as I said, I think this will probably be my last Jada and Will reading. Um, she and he are both as bad as each other. His response was egotistical, inauthentic, mechanical, and, and devoid of human emotion and devoid of touch, human touch. Him and his wife look super cray. And the only victims, the, 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 I would say the only victim, because God only knows the people that they've come into. Hey, did y'all hear that they wanted to have a threesome with J-Lo? <laughs> uh, let me come. Uh, my name is Miss Sam. This entire reading has been bullshit. It's just a chat. Conjecture. Okay. Ashe. Bless. Chukudalu. Inshallah. Later, let me go get something to drink. I can feel my voice. It's kind of... <laughs>